We have a nice full house tonight. Woo! Woo! Yeah, I guess I should have asked for the applause. <laughs> so basically, the way we are going to work out this evening is I am going to ask silly questions before our main speaker comes up. You are going to win really cool books. You want to show off the book? <laughs> you will also take home pens. You want to show off the pens? <laughs> and just take one and pass the rest. We had too many pens, we had too many pens to, give, to, to do it in like the normal format, so I'm just going to have this bag go around the room. Yeah. We are also going to give away to one person. Let's see, who knows what this is? Everyone said Raspberry Pi. Good. It is a Raspberry Pi 3, the newest one with the full kit. And a full development kit, HDMI cable, and all that stuff in there. To win that, what you do is you put your business card in this bowl that's going to pass it around. I'm going to ask you to take that pass it around. At the end of the evening, we will raffle it off. You do have to be here to win it. You do have to have a business card in there. If you don't have a business card, you can make one up on a piece of paper. Write on anything that you feel like writing on. But it does have to look like a business card. <laughs> Okay, so I've got more stuff to give away. I will be giving away these Postgres administration cookbooks. Ooh, ooh. By show of hands here, who can cook? <laughs> People have your hands down, I'm sorry. <laughs> Not eaten by you. So the way this is going to work is I'm going to hand out the pretty random goodies. Based on who answers my questions, they don't have to be correct answers. They just have to be good, funny answers. You can answer completely wrong, and if I want to give you a prize, I will give you one. Simple like that. You do need to shout out answers. If you raise your hands, I won't hear you. You have to just shout out everything. Most of my questions are either really simple or trick questions or numeric. Everyone can count in the room, right? So let's start with a number one. What's the maximum size of a table in Postgres? One. One, one what? <laughs> one eat for effort. <laughs> No, it's a, it's a byte size. 64 terabyte? 64 terabyte is exactly double, double the correct answer. <laughs> <laughs> Don't raise your hands. 32 terabytes. <laughs> okay, what is the maximum amount of data that can be stored in a Postgres database? Unlimited. Unlimited is correct. Can you pass that back and I, there's two there so someone can steal one. Okay. <laughs> what is the name of the Postgres elephant? This deserves a cookbook. <sighs> Nadi is wrong. Dumbo. Dumbo is a E for effort. Who said that? I did. <laughs> <laughs> you guys can E for effort trying to steal you. <laughs> Anyone try it? What's the name of the elephant? I do. Hadoop is another is actually a very good guess, but no. Jimmy. No, Jimmy. No. No. Not Johnny, not Jimmy. Big. Big. Is it big. No, a name. Big. No. No. Anyway, alright guys, you all y'all give up? What? Shout it out. What? No, it's not that either. It's Slonik, so never mind. Uh, <laughs> we'll try the next question. Hopefully it'll be a little easier. What mainstream, for another book by the way, what mainstream open source technology that mates very well with Postgres also has an elephant mascot? Hadoop, Hadoop. Hadoop is not the, not the answer out of my paper, but it is correct. Another one. What else? PHP, I heard PHP from the back. That's correct. Who said that? What is that? <laughs> what is the put PSQL command to list all databases? This is dead simple. List, right? right. Oops, sorry. That one, that one wasn't supposed to leave my hand. But anyway, give it to whoever wants it. Okay. What function does the open source Postgres tool PG Bouncer do? This is a tough one. It bounces. Yes, that's totally wrong. Okay. The next question is similar in nature, but much easier. The second quadrant tool, Rep MGR, helps to manage what? Replication. Replication. Exactly. 
Take one and pass it around. See, when you win, everyone around you wins. <laughs> That's the point. All right, the next one is a numeric question. The numbers are sequential, so you have a li fairly limited amount of guesses until you just get it right. What is the default Postgres port? Five 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 five. Five. Yes, you always. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one more number question, and then I'll call it quits. What? Is, well, how many megabytes is the default size for WAL files? It's a number. Just guess. Thirty-two is, is half the right answer. Sixty-four. 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 I'm going to give away like a handful of these to the back of the room who's not loud enough to make it to the front of the room. <laughs> 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 